ever wondered how a huge ship, heavier than all your toys combined, floats on water while your little metal car sinks? Well, it's all about a magical force called buoyancy. Even though boats are heavy, they float because they push down on the water, and guess what? The water pushes them right back up. This push and pull between the boat and the water is what we call buoyancy. So remember, every time a boat floats, it's because the water is pushing it back up. Ever noticed how boats have a unique shape? They are broad and flat at the bottom, aren't they? This isn't just for looks. This shape helps boats push more water down, which in turn pushes them up, keeping them afloat. Now, think about when you're in a pool. If you lie flat, you float better than when you ball up, right? That's because a broader shape spreads out your weight, just like a boat. So the shape of a boat is a clever trick to enhance buoyancy and keep it sailing smoothly. Did you know boats have been around for thousands of years and have played a crucial role in history? In ancient times, people used boats for fishing and traveling. Just imagine, without boats, Christopher Columbus wouldn't have been able to set sail in 1492 and discover America. His ship, the Santa Maria, was designed to float and navigate the vast ocean, just like the boats we have today. So, boats not only float, but have also carried explorers to new lands and made our world what it is today. So, next time you see a boat floating, you know it's all about buoyancy and the right shape. Remember, a boat floats because it pushes water down and the water pushes it back up, creating a magical force. And the shape? It's essential in keeping the boat on the water's surface, just like when we lie flat in the pool. Isn't that fascinating? Thank you for sailing with us today. Don't forget to subscribe to Learn with Morale and share the fun facts you learned today with your friends.